excited? We're gonna have to name ah. her. I'm gonna get out of piggies. You can bring her back. Morning has come. We have been waiting months for this. I've actually been waiting a few years. <laughs> um, Nick just got home. He's doing some man stuff, tightening some high chairs. Um, we're going to pick up our piglet today. So this morning, we actually are on a kind of a tight time schedule, which kind of sucks, but we just don't have a choice. So we have to be back here in a little bit for an appointment for our remodel stuff. But this is not done, and any suggestions you guys have are welcome. But I got the pen mostly set up. We still need to do litter here. Someone told me to put a grate over this because they like to root around in the litter. I really hope that's not a thing for her. It seems like pigs are pretty clean, so if there's litter and or if there's like poop in it, she's not gonna do that, hopefully. Ferrets do that though. Um, we're gonna get a big map to go under here. I have some, uh, this is a tunnel. I've got some blankets for her and some um, water dishes and food dishes that are gonna go over here on this mat. That has like a little blanket over it. We've got some different toys for her, like like um, ones where you can move the little, like, like puzzle, treat puzzle type stuff. So we're gonna kind of introduce those little by little so she's not overwhelmed. Um, I got this little one so I could put like veggies in it and lettuce and stuff. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go get the mat and everything. So we're gonna go do that before we pick her up. But we're picking her up this morning and I have literally no idea what to expect. I feel really bad for her. She's like been living outside on a farm with her brothers and sisters and her mom and she's just gonna be kind of like ripped away and taken with like people. She's never been in a car before. Like I'm, I feel really bad for her actually. So we're gonna do our best to try to um, comfort her and make her feel at home. But yeah, we got our little crate out here ready to go. Thanks for grabbing that. Um, yeah, so that's the plan. I'm super stoked. How about you guys? Are you excited? <laughs> <laughs> you excited? We're gonna have to know her. Hello. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Excited. She's been loving doing this like surprise Excited. <gasps> oh, you love your daddy, huh? He just got home from work this morning. Dad, yeah, dad, dad loves hard. Yeah. Work. yeah. Oh, I see her. Yeah. So this is a brother that's bigger. She's still on the smaller side compared to the other siblings. And then there's one other sibling that has so all the other ones you see are younger. Hi. So, what do we have to expect tonight? Is this gonna be like a puppy screaming all nope, night? Nope, nope. Super really? quiet, curled up in the corner. Oh, I was like, maybe I'll sleep in there with her. <laughs> I mean, she would love that. If you're oh comfortable enough to do I just it. Need some padding and. <laughs> that, honestly, that's, she would love that. She's such a snuggle pig. Aww. Like, there's pigs that are pig pigs, and then like, the, they like to be with other pigs, and then there's pigs that like to be with other humans. She is, likes her humans. Aww. Those little brown ones are so cute. I know, that little, that little Adorable. I know, I know. So, so this is Paisley. Mama, huh? Yes. And then I have her the grandma too. She's real skinny because she was nursing yes. seven babies. Aww. Yes. And she's so Easy ready. Lady. So ready for them to go home. Um <laughs> and this is then the mama. This is the mommy. Who's this? This is Paisley. Paisley. Paisley's the sweetest. She's a hide of Paisley's mama? Or Paisley the mama? And normally she's all pink, but she's just dirty from rolling in the mud yesterday. <laughs> Gentle. Uh, Little one coming up to you. Look at the piggy. Yeah. Are you petting the piggy? You pet? Girl. Yeah. And then rather than going over her head, I don't know if you remember when under. Go under the chin. Okay. Under the chin and then high. <laughs> What's your daddy? Where's your daddy? Like, wait a minute, you were giving me love. And then, like, yeah. if, like under the armpit, she'll roll right over. <laughs> she's yeah. just, a, you guys, she's she's the <laughs> best. What a little. And you can hear her little like. Just got her home before we get her out. Nick had to give her some belly rubs. 
Look how cute she flopped over. I just brought her in. The kitties are very interested. I need to put a little bit of litter in her litter box over here. And then we can let her come out of there on her own time. Hey, sweet girl. We may have decided on a name. I'm not sure if it'll stick. We'll see. What's the name? Winifred. Winifred. Winnie. Winnie. Oh, is yeah. that picky? <laughs> she took her first poop, and I was curious what it was gonna look like. Uh oh, she's eating a plant over there. Um, and it looks like a dog turd, actually. And. That's pretty big, <laughs> bigger than I was expecting, but at least it's not like ferret poop. Piper, have you seen the pig? Yeah, I wouldn't allow her to get too close. I just kind of like... <laughs> oh, what a good girl. Supposedly this is pretty like not typical for a pig to let you hold them, especially on the first day. So we're kind of pushing it, but she is not really good. good. Really good. Look at these tiny cute little clothes. Look at these little babies. We actually have to get her fixed in about a month as well. So you're supposed to do it between, I think she said what, three and six months? Three and four months, but fat starts to grow around their their early parts. So it's better to get it done sooner. Jenna said when we were trying to pick which baby to get. Mm -hmm. She's like, she just looks sweet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Except, are you gonna be able to take that? She's doing so good. She was just laying over there for a while by herself. Thank you. Well, said that the pig wasn't going to be allowed on the couch, and she is on the couch the very first night without even having a bath yet. Did I say that? I said that. I was uh -oh. like, she's not going on the couch. I mean, actually, I really think I don't want her on the couch, but it's okay for tonight. <laughs> mm. We are playing Rummy Cub. And I would say that was a really good first day with Winnie. What do you guys think about the name? I think it's really cute. But we will see you in the next video. If you want more pig content, give this a thumbs up. Bye guys. Good morning. This is editing Kristen, or this is Kristen a few days later. I just wanted to show you guys a real look at what this area looks like. So I deep cleaned this, scrubbed this all, vacuumed it all on my hands and knees yesterday. And this morning it is completely thrashed again. So I just wanted to show you, hello, a realistic idea of the amount of work having a pen inside is. This reminds me of having rabbits. It's very similar. Um, 
So yeah, it needs to be cleaned pretty often. We're about to get a higher edge litter box so that it's a little bit better. And we're also going to build a wood baser on this so she cannot push these sides out even just that little bit. So that will help, but they are very messy eaters and drinkers. <laughs> so there's no way around that. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to pop this in here for a little bit of a reality check um, because I don't want to be inspiring anyone to get an animal that they're not going to be able to manage or you know, they have an expectation that this area is going to be super, super clean. These need to be cleaned like every other day as well. Um, so yeah. Say good morning, mini mini. Yeah. You also peed in my office last night, didn't you? I caught her, so I was able to put her in the litter box, um, but she had a little bit too much free range time and space. So we are going to dial that back a little bit. But other than that, you've been really good with your potties.